over the years there are fewer journalists and therefore of course what you call investigative reporting is now much less done than it used to be years ago. The thing I think that bothers me most is the real potential for a democratic deficit as a result of a lack of local community reporting. And I say that as often the only journalist on a hyper-local to attend full council meetings of Lambeth Council. I mean, I still get calls from people who just need a bit of help with whether it's housing, and it usually is housing in our area actually, um, and they just want someone to put in a phone call to the local authority. So our job is to get the stories in the newspaper, but there's a greater social role that local newspapers have always had. From the journalist's point of view, is is really one of being uh, overstretched in trying to out of goodwill and uh, love of journalism, trying to plug these gaps where they've emerged. So, you know, we've seen staff who uh, have experienced stress and been unwell as a result of the pressures that, that they're facing. Newspapers are very, very expensive things mm. to produce because they depend on human beings who need to eat and they need somewhere to live. So rather like the National Health Service, actually producing a, a news service is an extremely expensive enterprise if you're going to do it properly. Well, the way forward, unfortunately, for the big chains has been to cut, cut, cut 